The Minecraft 1.17 campaign. In this video, I have to beat Minecraft, but there's a twist. I started version 1.0 and I have to get to version 1.17 by reaching the goal for every version. For example, in 1.0, if I get stone tools and enough food, I can go to version 1.1. When I get iron tools and armor, I can go to version 1.2, until eventually I reach version 1.17 and I have to fight the Wither and the Ender Dragon at the same time while I have fully enchanted diamond gear, a netherite tool and an elytra. This is by far the biggest video I've ever made, so I hope you enjoyed. Let's begin the 1.17 campaign. Look at this, Minecraft version 1.0. This update came out almost 10 years ago and I haven't played it since then. Let's do this, let's go. This is the world that we're going to stick with for 17 Minecraft versions. This is already so weird. Is that a desert? I think jungles usually spawn near deserts, so if we get to version 1.2, we might find one of those. In this version, we need to get stone tools, all of them, and we have to get a decent amount of food. Wait, why do I not have my skin? Oh, that's weird. Why is that? Okay, there's a lot of iron here. Oh, and there's even more iron right here. Like, we pretty much already have full iron armor at this point. I think this should be enough for all stone tools, as well as two furnaces. Let's get two furnaces and just a decent amount of food. Oh yeah, right, and swimming also sucks in this version. And it's not gonna be better for like 13 versions. Yeah, I forgot about that. This used to be all over the place. That's actually really interesting. Oh, actually, I, I just remembered, we can spam click things now. I still remember when they introduced the hunger system. Like, I was just so confused. I thought they had just implemented a time limit or something because I didn't actually know how to refill the hunger bars. Yeah, th this is more than enough. So we have all stone tools. We have enough food. I think it's about time to get to the next version. Here we go. Version 1.1. Oh, this is, this is weird. Like, I don't remember everything that this update added, but one thing that I do remember is that this update added the spawn eggs. Like, this was the first time that I actually waited for a Minecraft update. And this is also when I, like, really started getting into this game. Is there, like, a mob spawner nearby? Oh, there actually is. We have enough iron for iron tools and armor. Oh yeah, by the way, that was the goal for this version. I'm just gonna cut to the part where I have everything. And the iron is all done. Let's make the rest of our tools. I don't need a hoe, <laughs> let's be honest. In later versions, hoes are not that bad, but in this version, yeah, you can basically do nothing with them. Like, we don't need to get a diamond hoe or something. But yeah, full iron armor, all iron tools. It's time to get to the next version. Welcome to version 1.2. We did get a new biome in this update which is the jungle. I guess I'll just walk around for a bit. Maybe we'll find one. Like another thing that we got was different plank variations. Yeah, look at that. We have a jungle right here. Oh yeah, you can see the chunk borders. <laughs> look at that. In this version, we have to get one golden apple. Yeah, let's just stick down. What's going on with this F3 menu? <laughs> oh, look at that. We found gold and a cave. Yeah, there we go. Oh, we, and we have lapis. That's also nice. Yeah, we are on diamond level, actually. But I guess right now we should just cook up our gold. Now we just get our gold. And I think you need gold ingots for a golden apple, right? Oh, you don't. You need golden nuggets. So we can just make three golden apples. There we go. So in case something goes wrong, we'll be fine. Time for version 1.3. This is version 1.3. Oh, wait, look at this. Diamonds, nice. We got two diamonds. And that's also the goal we had in this update, just finding diamonds. I didn't even have time to talk about this update too much. I guess we should get going and get to the next update. Version 1.4. This, again, was a really good update. In this update, we got our second boss, the Wither. We also got Wither skeletons, mob heads, bats for some reason. No one likes them. Wait, hold on, is that a spider spawner? When did they remove spider spawners? That's really interesting, actually. As far as I know, they're not in the game right now. Oh, what? Wait. Wait, 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 wait. That skeleton didn't have a bow. The goal for this version 
is a bit more ambitious. We need to get all iron tools. We need 11 diamonds. Oh, that's a one vein. Oh, no, it's not. We got six diamonds. Nice. Oh, wait. A bow. I think it's time to strip mine. We already found a cave. <laughs> With a whole lot of redstone and diamonds. Wait. Let's keep going. Let's make a diamond pickaxe. Oh, there we go. Is that an 8 vein? That's an 8 vein. There we go. We have 12 diamonds. Let's see. We can make a diamond sword, a diamond axe, and a diamond shovel. And we still have 6 diamonds left. Yeah, we have all diamond tools. You can probably see where this is going. Let's move on to the next version. Here we go. Version 1.5. This is the redstone update. I don't do redstone, so it doesn't really have a lot of meaning to me. But now that we have all diamond tools, we need to get a full set of diamond armor. We don't have to do all of that in this version, but we have to get half of it now. Oh, that was fast. It's a six vein, I think. Yeah, we got 12 diamonds. You can hold right click and drag items in your inventory. That's so useful. Oh yeah, and we have half diamond armor. That was fast. That was really quick. Look at that. Let's move on to the next update. All right, version 1.6. We got horses and I think hay bales. And that's about it. Like, don't get me wrong, I think horses are a good addition to this game, but really, it just really feels like a filler update. Oh, there we go. Oh. Oh, there we go. That's five diamonds. We have full diamond armor, by the way. <laughs> Look at that. Full diamond armor. Okay, that was really fast, actually. That didn't take long at all. Let's go to version 1.7. Here we go. This is a big update. This might be the single most important update in Minecraft history. We got a ton of new biomes, changes to how skins work. So now I have my skin back. Look at that. We got new settings, we got changed settings. And there's just so much to this update, including really weird flickering. Is this because of Optifine? I think 1.16 might be my most played version. But if it's not 1.16, then it's definitely 1.7. Oh, and we got an ender pearl. That's nice. We were underground for so long, and all this time there were like minor changes to how the overworld looks. It'll be interesting to see what it looks like now. But for now, there's something else we need to do. We need to get an enchantment table. We might as well get the obsidian right now. Oh, finally. Oh, we did it. We finally did it. That took so long, but we did it. And here we go. Finally back on the surface. And now we can actually get food again. Oh yeah, by the way, we also need leather. Let's make an enchantment table. Finally. I can't believe we're actually getting to 1.8. Here we go. 1.8. Enchanting has been revamped. We don't actually lose all of our levels. And there we go. Everything fully enchanted. Of course, there's something else we need to do in 1.8. And that something is going to the nether. So we might die. But yeah, let's just make this portal. I messed this up already. I swear, I know how to do this. Oh, it's the exact same thing. It still works. <laughs> Look at that. I think it's time. Time to go to the nether. Let's do this. Oh, I forgot how ugly the nether is in... <laughs> like before 1.14. Let's get some soul sand for later. After all, we do have to fight the wither later. We also have to summon the ender dragon. So getting a guest here would be pretty convenient. Oh God, not even close. But yeah, of course our main objective is to find another fortress and get all the blaze rods. I guess it would be. Please don't die. Please don't die. Please don't die. Don't die, please. And this is why we took the golden apples. So we already got two gas tiers. Oh, there we go. Blazes are interesting now. Like on one hand, we can kill them pretty quickly, but we also can't use a shield, so they're pretty dangerous. So we need some blaze rods. I don't know how many we're gonna get. Let's go for 10. And there we go. We can leave now. But before I do, let's go to the next version. And here we go. 
everyone's favorite version 1.9 the combat update it introduced cooldown and everyone seems to hate it like this you can't spam click anymore people did not like this update at all i mean we did get a lightress so that's a big plus also the end was completely revamped and that also includes the ender dragon right now our goal is to find the strongholds okay i think this should be far enough But hey, look at that, we're in the savannah. That's how we know we're far away from spawn. Slowly but surely, it does start to feel like the new version. We are going this way. Oh, I think we also got actually good boats now. Yeah, look at that. The boats don't break instantly anymore. Yeah, you can see how boring the oceans actually are right now. There's no shipwrecks, no kelp. Desert temple, I forgot about that. Oh my god. The old desert village, it's so ugly. Let's go over there. So if we throw a pearl now, we should have a pretty good idea of where the stronghold actually is. It... Okay. Good thing I did that. It's really close, actually. Somewhere in this ocean. So I assume if we go straight down now, we should be able to find it. Oh yeah, here it is. We did it. We found the stronghold. We have... Blast protection, feather falling. Oh yeah, I'm taking that, that's really good. Let's get to the next version. So, 1.10. The most notable thing about this version is that the version number now has two digits. Like we got polar bears and yeah, they don't even do anything. Oh, also didn't this update add auto jump? Yeah, it did. This is probably the worst Minecraft update. But yeah, the goal for this version is to just find the portal room and fill it in. Oh, there we go. That's it. And it's a two eye. That's actually not bad. Yeah, look at that. We're missing three eyes. Oh, there's an enderman. And there we go. Feather falling. Boom. Like, it's going to take 10 more minutes, but we could just wait for the sun to go down. Yeah, I think I'm just going to wait. Almost there. How strong is feather falling, actually? That's really good. There we go. I mean, it's like 20 blocks, but still, first try. I'm losing my mind because I had nothing to do for the past 20 minutes. And there's another one. There we go. We need one more ender pearl. It's, it's raining. It's raining. That's bad. Yeah, what am I going to do about this? Okay, wait, I could try and find a desert. I'm pretty sure there was a desert nearby. Is that it? Oh, there's a savanna. That's good enough. So, it's not raining here, so we can actually find Enderman. Come on, the night is ending again. Give me just one more pearl. There we go. Literally at the last second. Alright. There we go. We are done with this version. And in 1.11, we'll have to fight the Ender Dragon. Here we are. This is it. I think we're ready. Three, two, one, go. This is after 1.9. This is the end fight we know. Except these explosions look completely different. Can you not shoot them through the thing? Yeah, you can't. Well, we just gotta do it like this. Oh god! Well, <laughs> thanks, I guess. Also, can we just appreciate these explosions? The feather falling just saved us. Oh god. This ender dragon is aggressive. There we go. Please don't kill me. Oh no. Okay, there we go. That's all the crystals gone. Now we just need to kill it. I think one cycling doesn't even work in this version. Yeah, look at that. But we can use TNT to do this. Oh, look at how much damage that did. It's down again. Yeah, this is going well. <laughs> oh, oh no. This would kill us. Oh, it's so high up. Oh, oh my god. Just stay there for one more second. And it's done.
That's the Ender Dragon defeated. We're in the end game now. There's only a few things remaining. Oh, there's the end gateway. You might be able to tell where this is going. It's time to get to version 1.12. We just got a lot of achievements. Yeah, version 1.12. Uh, apparently we got more advancements for the campaign. That just means we have to get an elytra. Let's hold on. Oh yeah, apparently that's the first mob I've killed. No, no, I don't, I don't like this. I don't like bridging with iron bars. We'll get some endstone. Oh, there we go. That was fast. So does this have an end ship? Nice. Let's go. The city at the end of the game. Okay, so we have to get all the way up there. Oh god. Oh, that actually worked. <laughs> nice. Come on. Die. This is a pretty good pickaxe. I'll take it. And there it is. Elytra. Oh, it works. Look at us. Oh, we got mending. I guess this is all we're getting from this. But look at this, we can just fly around now. I guess I might as well put some of my stuff in because like, we will eventually get our own ender chest. I still want to get a sugar box. Okay, we got everything we need. We can leave. Let's try and get one more ender pearl. Actually, we need a bunch for the end crystals as well. And we died. The good thing is that our stuff won't despawn. The bad thing is that we actually have to get back there and we have nothing. Oh, the thing is, we need an ender pearl and that's so difficult to get. Actually, hold on. It is difficult to get an ender pearl, but we don't need to get an ender pearl. In this version, you can't just swim in or use a trapdoor or something. You can't swim until version 1.13. I thought that we couldn't go to 1.13 since we hadn't reached our objective yet, but we did get the elytra. We can technically go to 1.13. And so we just need a bucket and we'll be able to go into the end. Okay, I think at this point it's more convenient for us to go to version 1.13. Let's go. Okay, actually, how am I gonna survive this? Oh god, no, 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 no. Like, we can make a bucket right now. So let's see, is it really that impossible to get to where we want to go? I'm just blocking myself in now. Let's just wait it out. And it's daytime. Right, here we go. Let's go in. Yeah, this is not as easy as I thought, but it's doable. Where's our stuff? It's over there. Oh, we got everything back. Oh, that's relieving. Let's just get out. Now we need all the resources to actually fight the Ender Dragon and the Wither. In 1.13, we need to get four End Crystals. So we already got the Eyes of Ender for that. We also need the glass, we can smelt that. So now we just need to get some gas tears. And I know I said that we need the gas tears, but we also need wither skeleton skulls. We might be able to just skip 1.14 if this keeps up. Okay, come on. And that's the last gas tier. We're done with this. At this point, we actually have everything we need to fight the Wither and the Ender Dragon. Like, can we just talk about this? I got an extra skull without even noticing. There we go. There is a little bit more preparation that we could do. Let's go to version 1.15. 1.15. This is actually a pretty recent version. The game looks so much better. Like, all the textures are different. Something I noticed is that my description of what I have to do now is extremely vague. In every other case it's very specific. In this case it's just get enchantments. So I guess I'll just get enough to the point where I feel comfortable fighting the Wither and the Ender Dragon at the same time. But yeah, let's get some wood. Yeah, that should be enough. <laughs> let's find a village. Okay, there's some weird bug going on. I can just set their profession from far away. Wait, power two. Yeah, let's get four of those. So now we can get power four. I mean, that's almost a village. Just cut off. Wait, protection four. That's pretty good. I guess two of them should be enough. Infinity, that's actually really useful. Mending, thank you. Mending on our elytra. Let's equip that. And also mending on our boots because they're pretty important. And infinity on the bow. We're now ready. Or at least we would be. There's one more thing that I want to do. The goal of 1.16 is to get one netherite ingot. Let's get into the second last version. 
here we are, 1.16, the nether update. Other than maybe 1.7, this is my most played version. So there are a few things that this update introduced, and one of the more important ones is netherite. First, we need to find new nether chunks. Yeah, there's basalt there. Yeah, let's just dig down right here. Let's do the last bit of grinding. Oh, there we go. Oh, wait. Oh my god. There was a layer of blackstone in front of that. Good thing I ducked there. We're already done. That didn't take long at all. I was pretty lucky, actually. <laughs> what do we turn into netherite? Yeah, let's put it on the sword. Let's make the netherite ingot. Put in the sword, put in the netherite ingot. Make a netherite sword. Here we go. I'd say that we're ready. Let's go over here. Take the four end crystals, the four soul sand, and the three with the skeleton skulls. Here we go. Version 1.17. This is the end. It's almost the cave update, and at this point, it's the most recent update. This is what we prepared for. A battle against the Ender Dragon and the Wither. Let's go. We don't have too many rockets, but that should be fine. Let's summon the Ender Dragon first. Oh god, <laughs> it's happening. All right, let's put down the template for the Wither. Get all of the things we need. Come on, Ender Dragon. And the Wither. Here we go. This is it. And let's go. Let's aggro the Wither just to make it more exciting. Okay, now we can begin. So let's first take out the end crystals. If the wither somehow damages the ender dragon, we want that damage to count. That's why we're doing this first. Oh, this is so cool. Okay, that's all the end crystals gone. Wait, the wither is actually after the ender dragon. Let's try and get the wither down, but it's just like right above the ender dragon. Like there's nothing we can do, except taking off. Come on with it. Oh, oh my God. Come on with it. Okay, so as long as the wither is targeting the ender dragon, we can just shoot it with arrows. Yeah, this is perfect. Yeah, it's entering its second phase. Come on, just leave. They're just fighting each other. But that's actually not a good thing because we need to kill the wither. Okay, let's drink the healing potion. I guess we need to kill the dragon first, because otherwise we won't be able to take down the wither. Actually, no, it's down here. Come on. Die. Okay, we did it. The wither is down. Now it's just the ender dragon left. Come on, don't die. We're almost there. Come on, ender dragon. It's time to die. Oh my god, the elytra is broken. These last six hours won't be for nothing. You are going down. You are going down! We did it. We did it. This is it. This is the end. We just finished the Minecraft 1.17 campaign. This has been so exhausting, but also so much fun. Normally, this is where I end the video, but this time, let's just take a look around the world. Of course, we have the portal room, which is kind of a hub right now. Yeah, that's the fortress that we found. Let's go back to spawn. I want to see this. Oh, this is spawn. Yeah, this is apparently a river. Oh my god. Yeah, look at all these chunk borders. Let's go over here. I'll be honest, this was probably the most exhausting, but also the most fun video I've made so far. If you want to do this challenge as well, I'll put the rules in the description. Thank you all for watching, and until next time, goodbye.